and you're an opposition activist. Do you think any of these people have any chance against Putin? Or is that just fantasy by the West, trying to ratchet up the pressure on the country in order to try to get Russian people to, you know, to whatever they do? On this stage, that's absolutely, absolutely impossible to have to have change, uh, cha regime change by, by, I would say, democratic movement in Russia. Last year, Putin undertook all his efforts to destroy all democratic opposition. Just many of many people, many activists were put in jail. Many of them just uh, had to emigrate and live in other countries. And uh, and uh, creating fear that is absolutely was was a, a, a tactic last year. And right now, right now, there is no actual uh, democratic movement exists as a as a power. But as I said. People started to uh, to ask more questions, and the propaganda didn't uh, didn't provide them with the appropriate answers. That's why they 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 are maturing and waking up, but not enough on, during this year to be uh, massive demonstrations on the streets and claiming that Putin should 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 get out. Mm -hmm. it, it is in the future. If we now in the war with Ukraine, Ukraine will win. And Putin will be seen as defeated, and the, that will be beginning of Putin's era end. Mm -hmm. And Mikhail Kasyanov, can you just explain from your perspective what is Putin's obsession with Ukraine? I mean, this has been going on for a long time, and and also the fact that he's wrapped himself partly in a religious blanket. The Patriarch of Russia, Kirill, has actually blessed the military commanders of Russia who've gone in to wage this war. What is Putin's obsession with Ukraine? The, the major point for Mr. Putin is uh, the recognition by the West, recognition of Crimea as a Putin's uh, Russia territory. That's the major point. Uh, all others, like NATO threat and others, that is just artificial explanation. He needs recognition by himself and respect in the world, that he is a, a great world uh, leader, etc. He, he thought in 2014, that after annexation, he would bribe uh, Western politicians. And in a few months, they would recognize the, the, that Crimea is part of Russia. But eight years passed, and nothing happened uh, like that. West appeared to be more principled than Putin expected. Putin believes, and right now, that everything is, is saleable in the world. The, the only question is price. But the West, this time, appeared to be too principled. And transatlantic unity shocked Mr. Putin. And those sanctions, the packages of sanctions which were imposed, shocked him. He didn't expect such a reaction. That's why he's nervous. That's why he's so angry on everyone.